Callum, do you think you scored a faster goal than that before? Um, well, I don't really score much, so no, nah, I don't think I have. But um, some were saying it was an own goal, but it was never an own goal. It was definitely mine. But yeah, it was um, nice to get off the mark. We've seen you pop up in the penalty area quite a lot this season. I mean, that's that's obviously something that's changed in the role. Yeah, 100%. Um, I've been asked to get into the back post and obviously wing back allows me to do that as well as defend. But um, no, it's popping up in areas where I can score or make things happen, which is what I did um, on Tuesday. So, yeah, it's good. Um, we've seen you in that more advanced position and, and it, it's one you seem to be thriving in at the moment. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Um, it's you just got to work off the back of some confidence and obviously scoring that early gave me the confidence to go on and have the game that I did so it was good I, I enjoyed it and um no I really like wing back it gives me the uh, like the ability to get up and down and obviously playing with Regan as well it, it was good yeah um I was going to mention Regan actually you, you both seem to strike up a really quick partnership when you played at AFC yeah um, no he's good he, he likes to get around me as well and it's good to talk to and he gives me the like that allowance to go and get in the box because he is there secure behind me and then when he wants to go I'll step in and stay as well so yeah it's a good little partnership. Um, I think you were one of the, the top performers certainly for me in, in the pre-season campaign. Has, has something changed in you over the summer? Um, I just tried to go away and get as fit as I possibly could and come back confident and just willing to go and give it my all this season so yeah I, I'd say more of a mindset than anything. And so what? So what? What needs to change when? When? Uh, you know, not that you had a bad season last season, obviously p picking up promotion, but you know, what? What's changed over the summer mentally for you? Um, last season was definitely a lot of ups and downs for me, and I just thought I went away, spoke with my dad, spoke with other people, and just gaining that confidence back really to come back and kick on again. But obviously the promotion was amazing and. Going away, spending some time away that summer with promotion on your back obviously does give you that confidence to come back and really come back, hit the ground running. So I think I have done that. Um, league One, probably a little bit more football played than, <laughs> than in League Two. I mean, has that made it easier for you as well? Um, yeah, prob maybe, yeah. Um, I'm not the most physical of players and League Two is a very physical league. But, know, you can um, throw yourself about a bit. <laughs> I do throw myself <laughs> about, yeah. But... Um, no, I, obviously I started playing in League One when I first broke through, so um, to get back into League One is nice and to be playing football again is nice, but I think the structure and the way we play like involves me a lot and I think that helps me as well. Are you not exhausted when you come off the pitch at the moment, having covered pretty much every <laughs> blade of grass on, on Tuesday night? After Tuesday I was absolutely knackered, yeah, and after going into midfield and asking to rat about in there as well, yeah, I was I was exhausted, but got a game Saturday so I have to recover <laughs> I mean it is a pretty relentless schedule at the moment isn't it I mean is it is it tough for the players coming in I think it's nine games in five in the opening five weeks that's you know there's, there's barely any time off yeah it's relentless um there's a lot of games and but we've got a lot of players we've got a good depth of good quality and depth in our squad so um yeah there'll be players looking to come in and players obviously looking to go out but um no it is relentless and it is a bit um nasty on the legs <laughs> Um, Peterborough this weekend, um, I suppose one of MK Don's most long-standing rivals. These are the games you sort of get up for, aren't they? Yeah, 100%, especially um, last time we played them here. It was the nine men, I think it mm. was. Um, that was a great game. And yeah, it would be um, it would be an interesting affair, but um, I'm looking forward to it. How do you think uh, Don's have started in League One so far? I think we've just kicked on to where we should really be, to be honest. Um, obviously, we had that blip two seasons ago and then we've Tiz has come in done really well worked really well with the players and I think we're back to where we should be as a club and going moving forward it should be positive